Hello everybody, it's me. I'm here today with some Black Rifle Coffee Company Espresso Mocha, naturally and artificially flavored. This is uh, something I just saw yesterday. I've heard of this, but I didn't know that they uh, did canned coffee. Uh, I think uh, canned coffee is pretty underrated and uh, that we need to have more of that. So it's nice to see something that's not fucking Starbucks having uh, canned coffee. Uh, veteran owned. Uh, American, or shit, America's coffee. Now I sound retarded. Naturally and artificially flavored. 200 milligrams of caffeine, QT 3.14 GF, 11 fluid ounces, a good source of protein, doubtful 100% Colombian coffee, good source of protein, okay, that just repeats that. The, mil the military veterans at Black Rifle Coffee Company have developed this kick-ass espresso mocha that is a blend of espresso, milk, cocoa, protein, and caffeine to help dominate your day. Serving suggestion, best served chilled or over ice. And this is, this is out of the fridge, a little warm though. That's been out for a few minutes. Refrigerate after opening, produced in the United States from domestic and imported ingredients, i.e. Colombian coffee. Enjoyed by date on can, proudly distributed by Black Rifle Coffee Company. 170 calories, one serving per container, 11 fluid ounces, 325 milliliters, two grams total fat, 3% of your daily value, 1.5 grams saturated fat, 8% of your daily value, 10 milligrams of cholesterol, 3%, 220 milligrams of sodium, 10%, 30 grams of carbohydrates, 11%, 23 grams total sugars, includes 14 grams added sugar, which is 28% of your daily value, 7 grams of protein, 14%, has a whole bunch of fucking uh, vitamins, not as much as like an energy drink, but you got Colombian brewed coffee, filtered water, coffee, low fat milk, non fat, ultra filtered milk, sugar, mal maltodextrin, chicory root fiber, I like chicory, cellulose gel, cocoa processed with alkali, sodium hydroxide, natural and artificial flavor, cellulose gum, caffeine and hydrous, carrageenan, as ascorbic acid, vitamin E, DL alpha, toco Feral vitamin A palmitate. This has some some ones that we've not seen before. That's interesting. Okay, well I'm I'm excited. I like canned coffee, so I'm gonna dive right in. I mean I like it. I like the idea. Oh man. Looks that's slightly off brown, I think. Okay, before I dive in, I'm gonna switch views here. All right, first taste. It's pretty good. I think if you're if you're a fan of the Starbucks stuff where you put a lot of sugar and cream in your coffee, you're not gonna like this at all. It's despite being the mocha espresso or whatever and having and it has milk and shit and sugar, it's still pretty bitter. Mostly in the aftertaste. Or like the tail end of like your sip that's going to be the most bitter and then you're going to have a slightly bitter aftertaste whereas most of the sugar and milk is very upfront but besides that i mean it's just good it tastes kind of like coffee a little chocolatey actually 
which is, I think is the intention. Uh, just very slightly chocolatey. Oh yeah, boys. Mm -hmm. This is good. I'd get this again if I wanted canned coffee, which is rare. But sometimes it's you know it's what you want, and this this is a good one. Yeah, very chocolatey. The more I drink, the bitter goes away. The more like you're sipping. And it becomes very chocolatey. I guess that's mo the mocha, really. And I mean, that is the flavor. It's mocha espresso. Ooh, sorry, a little interruption there. Uh, what would I rate it? I'd rate it like a... 6.5 out of 10. I love the idea of canned coffee. I think we need more canned coffees. And I like canned coffee. And I like this one. I like this one more than the Starbucks, I think. Uh, but I'm, I'm, I'm a hot coffee guy. I like my coffee hot. Uh, I'm waiting for those cans that you open them and they heat up. Are those a fucking thing? Am I right? Am I wrong? I think those are a thing. I'm ready for those, but 6 point, yeah, I think I said 6.5 out of 10, 6.5 out of 10, that wasn't what I said, it's my final, but yeah, that was good, that's good, bye.